Hey, this is HKPSG1 Shooter uh, with a quick video here of uh, something pretty unique uh, aquaculture of rainbow trout on the South Carolina coast uh, simply because people told me that it couldn't be done and I'm here to prove otherwise so let's watch okay this one here this was taken on October 9th of 2012 when the trout first got here from Rowan Mountain Tennessee they were transported uh, in an insulated cooler with an aerator in it. Uh, at this point, they're three, maybe four inches long, if that. Uh, the water that they were in was 64 degrees, and my pond water was about 78. So I knew that transferring them directly to the pond would kill them. So what I've got here is a small holding tank uh, in a room in my house with a window unit air conditioner running set it about 65 degrees to keep it nice and cool while I'm waiting on the pond temperature to warm up and you can see there they're eating really good already being that size okay now here they are in November November 9th 2012 uh, shortly after being transferred into the pond uh, you can see them down there swimming around the bottom let's zoom in on one right here hardly even really looks like a trout. It looks more like some kind of uh, minnow or something that you'd find in a freshwater stream, but those are trout. And you can see they're starting to act like trout. Still feeding them very small size pellets here, maybe 3 30 seconds of an inch diameter pellets. Uh, but that's the smaller fish you see there at the top. Those are mosquito fish. And this is a brim right here, just to show you for reference how small the trout really are. Alright, next video. This was taken January 9th, 2013. You can see them aggressively feeding on the surface here. And here they are underwater. You can see that the size has now increased to probably 7 to 8 inches in length. Uh, it's an amazing growth rate. And these things eat like piranha. I mean, you feed them, and five minutes later, you can throw more food in the pond, and it's like they haven't eaten at all. It's just amazing. I just still can't get over how fast they grow. And I'm still kind of amazed at the fact that they actually lived in here at all. Okay, so now here's one more video. This was taken uh, just a few days ago, April 9th, 2013. You can see now that these fish are anywhere between 12 to 14 inches long and they've pretty much got acclimated to the point that they take food out of my hand you know I've a couple of them I can pick them up out of the water with my hand and then put them back in it's kinda cool but uh you know this is a neat little operation this is my first time trying this this is the first season of it so I'm doing a lot of experimenting and taking notes of what's going on. You can see from uh, October to April the increase in size. They are definitely harvestable size fish now. So this is a pretty neat little thing I got going here. They said it couldn't be done, but there it is.